As many of you know, I use Darktable to edit images. But we gotta talk about something. Darktable has a problem, and that problem is denoising. Darktable's denoising methods leave a bit to be desired, and there's one thing that Darktable does that is very hard to fix in Darktable. With very noisy images, it leaves dark and light specks that look sort of like salt and pepper sprinkled on your images. Ooh, I'm hungry. Unfortunately, no combination of settings really fixes this problem. But there is a way to fix it, and that is with raw therapy. The idea is as follows. Before we start, make sure to download raw therapy, which is another open source raw developer. Okay, here are the steps. First, do all your basic edits in Darktable, including a bit of denoising if you want. Since Darktable has masks, I especially recommend doing any selective denoising in Darktable. However, let's check out what Darktable has done after denoising. Look at this texture here. It's quite ugly because there are some dark flecks in the image. You can smooth the texture here a little bit by dragging this graph up, but it doesn't do a great job and it doesn't really completely get rid of the black and white dots. To fix it properly, export a full-sized JPEG. Then open it up in raw therapy. Now, zoom into a problem area so we can see the effects of the denoise. Finally, go to the Detail tab in Raw Therapy and find the Impulse Noise Reduction Module and turn it on. You may need to turn up the slider a little, but 50 is a good default value. You'll see that almost all the black specks go away. That's it. It fixes Darktable's problem. You can also try the Noise Reduction Module below if there's still a little noise. This module works better than Darktable's Noise Reduction for Luminance Noise. To use it, first turn it on. Then, Drag the Detail Recovery Slider to maximum. Now drag the Luminance Recovery Slider to a high value, say 80. Then, slowly drag the Detail Recovery Slider down until the noise disappears to your satisfaction, but the detail is still retained. If you drag the Detail Recovery Slider down a little too low, the actual detail will start to be eroded, so don't push it too far down. That's it. If you've got a really noisy image and you're noticing that Darktable doesn't do the best job even after following my tips in the ultimate denoising guide video I made, add raw therapy to your workflow with these tips to significantly improve your noise reduction. And let's hope Darktable implements impulse noise reduction. I hope this helps and I'll see you again next time.